guys, in this episode, I'm going to talk about the story when I'm making a bag. At first, I was thinking that making a bag should be hard. I need to have the equipment, I need to have the machine and a lot of stuff that might be uh, complicated and I didn't have it. So how I can still make a bag without that stuff, how I can figure it out. And maybe the results not the same because when you're using a great equipment like a machine and stuff that, that will help you to make your job easier, it will be different than uh, the stuff that I use, like simple stuff. It definitely impacting the result but my goals right now is just to making a bag by myself it's not to make it as perfect as I can like of course I make it as as good as I can right with the equipment that I have but at first when you start nothing is perfect you start from somewhere so I just decided okay I'm gonna start to making this bag with the equipment and the stuff that I have and I use my uh, old jeans it was skinny jeans that I never use it anymore because also it's a little bit smaller and I cut two of them and then combine it and make a pattern and it become a bag and after after I finish it, I really like the result because I put a lot of effort on it. I'm glad to myself that I can make it finally. I, I'm not just only thinking that I will make it and then just in imagination that okay, one day I will make a bag by myself, but I turn it into reality and I make it, I do the work and then right now I have that bag with me and I really like it because it's unique and it's different. That's only one probably in this world. So no one can can be the same bag with me. So that's kind of cool when you use it and then you walk in the street and you are different. No, you know what I mean, right? So during the process, I recut some videos it's not all but some clip that I record so you can see it, the process how I swing it uh, part by part and during the cutting it's a little bit took time because I use the manual method using my hand to swing but still I made it so that's the point that I did the work done so right now I have the bag, so I will, wait, wait a moment, I will take the bag with me right now. So yeah, this is the bag that I make. Hmm. Yeah, I put two pocket here, like in front, so I can put my smartphone here. Um, for here, it's like stuff, small stuff like keys or even your wallet can put here and also at the back, I put one also. And I have this mix stripe here and here is another color. This color is matched with the back. Uh, with the base of the bag and this color is matched with the pocket because I used two two jeans as I told you I used two jeans and the color is this one so that's why I made this bag I really like it so I will wear this when I going out for coffee just for a simple uh, outfit and that's all and I will show you the process that I've been through to make that bag and also in this episode I'll cover when I record uh, 
video and then turn it to a photo for my Instagram post because I using tripod like I don't I don't have someone to take a picture for me and I figure it out so I use the tripod I just take a video and then take a screenshot which part that I like and sometimes I use the timer for that so I will show you the, during the shoot and that activity mostly I do for creating my content for Instagram and even for this video I recorded by myself that's only me here to making a content for my Instagram I use a tripod and then I just you know trying to pose and took the good part from the video and turn it into the photo and maybe the quality is not really good because of that and it's not really sharp when you're taking a picture like you use the picture mode comparing the video and then after that you screenshot from that video but at least right now I can do it to make something that you really obsess of 
Go for it. Make it. Try to find a way to make it. There's a lot of ways that you can make or you can achieve your goals. It's not only one way. You need to find another way. In this example, I make a bag. My goal is want to make a bag. And there's a lot of ways that I can make a bag. I can make it with a machine. I can go to the tiler and then told them that I want to make a bag and then give them the pattern, give them the design and they do the work. And you also can do it like me, just doing manually and find your unique uh, pattern by yourself. And right now I could say that I did it. I achieved it, my small goals I achieved to make a bag. It wouldn't happen if I just think it how hard it is to make a bag because I don't have the equipment. If I still think it, like only think about it every single day, I wouldn't make that bag because I turn it into action. I will find a way, it doesn't matter. I'll find a way how to make a bag because that's my goal. So I find a way and I go to the store, I buy some simple equipment and then I make a bag and I did it right now, I have a bag with me and I I'm happy for that, I like that bag. So, when you have obsession with something, go for it. And when you have a dream, go for it. And find a way, and find your pattern through the process. And during the process, of course, you will find a problem to solve. And it will teach you to solve a problem and become better as yourself. It's not only to making your goal into the reality, but also you developing yourself, you grow it because you solved the problem. And that's all for this episode. If you have a dream, go for it. Don't afraid to take an action for it. And if you haven't subscribed my YouTube channel, uh, consider to subscribe. And if you like this channel, share to your friend, your family. And thank you for watching this video. Click the like button. And if you have some idea and also have some thought for this video you can write down in the comment i will glad to answer you and don't forget to follow my social media here my instagram and see you in the next video have a great day everyone remember your life it's what you make it so make it the best one